Hi guys, this is just another quick little segment about some more battery issues we've discovered. If you have been flying your Phantom 2 and found that it's suddenly hard to push upward or it just starts wanting to land for no good reason without warning, the chances are your battery is losing its charge and has just turned the corner of being useful. We have recently started discovering the problem with batteries that are less than 6 months old. They seem to hit around 47% on the battery meter and then start going into battery failsafe, with plenty of charge still remaining on screen and it can be a bit unnerving. The other problem is that the alarm doesn't go off, as I'm guessing it's preset not to start warning you until your battery is down to the prescribed 30%. So if the battery is in rapid discharge and goes down early, you get no notice whatsoever. Which is not cool when it's a long, long way away. We've had this happen now a number of times and the alarm then starts going off about 5 to 10 minutes after the event. So I guess there's not a heap you can do about it, but just try and keep your batteries labelled so you know which ones are which. And also don't leave your batteries in the shed at night if it gets cold, as this will also shorten their life quite considerably. We are now trialling 5400 milliamp hour batteries from a different manufacturer and we'll let you know how this goes. Okay, so that's it. Just a quick one. Please see our battery segments if you haven't already, as there is some other stuff around the alarms and the battery. And next up we look at battery standby power, and also the way to get your Phantom to do a long range flight. Okay, so that's it. Thank you Katie, and thank you Sonia, her new sister, just for being here and being you. And happy flying guys.